Alright everyone, my name is Mikhail 89 and welcome back to Elden Ring. Uh, last session we pretty much went ahead and continued through the mountaintop of the giants, um, when going through the Stargazer's Ruins, the Shack of the Lofty, uh, the Minor Erd Tree. Uh, we also fought the Death Rite Bird as well as the Tibia Mariner. And then finally when we went to Castle Soul and we got the second piece of the Halig Tree Secret um, Medallion, which was really awesome. Um, in this session, what we'll be doing is we'll be, to be, be continuing on through our journey into the mountaintop of the Giants. Uh, I think we'll be heading like southeast, like this part of the region, and we'll see how we go from there. I don't know whether or not I should um, use the Halig Tree um, medallion to go through the Grand Rift, uh, Grand Lift rolled, but we'll see how we go from here. But Anyways, hope you guys will enjoy it. If you missed the previous episodes or done for the series, you can check it out on our playlist on my YouTube channel. If you haven't already, uh, consider subscribing to the channel to stay up to date on games such as this and any other games we're playing at the moment. Alright, so, first thing, uh, we're going to be going, I think we're going over here to this lake, the frozen lake. And there's definitely going to be a boss here. I, I, there is no way there isn't one here. <laughs> there is no way there isn't one here. Where's that teardrop thing? I, I just heard it. Move it around. It's invisible. Don't know where it went. Oh, I got it. <laughs> Sipiku. Oh my goodness. That'll be an interesting move to use. All right, Night Maiden, Swordstress. What are we up against? Ooh. The snowstorm is getting is getting stronger. Ooh, jellyfish. <laughs> Borealis, the freezing fog. It's a dragon. Ah, shit. <laughs> oh, Jesus, that was close. Should I block here? I don't know what, I, what to do. I'm gonna block. Okay. Oh boy, I'm gonna run to- I'm gonna just shoot me to the left, just to the right here. <laughs> Got him down. Do I have enough time to hit him in the head? Do it. Yes! There we go. <laughs> oh, another dragon heart. A new draconic power was a, is available at the Cathedral of Dragon Communion. Very nice. First try as well. Happy about that. I have a lot of souls. I don't know. I don't like holding on to too many souls, to be honest. It's always, a, it's always scary. It's always a scary moment. Um, is that like a, a ruins? I think that's a ruins over there. It would have actually been cooler if like the whole fight had like that fog, I reckon.
There was a cool little entrance from that boss. Oh, we're going to be going to the rise as well. That's another thing. Is the kiln. Kiln on the first flame. <laughs> First Church of Marika. Oh. Okay. That's pretty cool. Got one level up. Um. Dex? I guess more Dex is fine. I don't know where the cap is for um, car speed. But I'll just level it up again. Another sacred tier. Going to plus 11? Why did that, why did that jellyfish go red for a moment? That was a, that was a little bit scary. Um, oh, we have, we have seven and seven on the flasks. Good. There we go, now we're at plus 11. Crimson and Solarian tiers, plus we've got 14 Estus in total. That's very nice. We might actually move, depending on how fast we get through all this, because I don't really want to go to the, to whatever that is up ahead. Um, I kind of want to save that for another time. We'll Smithing Stone tier 7, three of them. Um, but yeah, I think I want to actually save it for another, for another session, I reckon. Alright, let's get on Torrent here. We've got the spring thing, we've got... We've got some doggos. There you go. I think I'm able to cast at least one more, so... Oh, Jesus. Didn't think the dog would do that. <laughs> Golden Rune Tier 10. Golden Rune Tier 7. Whoops. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, never jail. Man, a lot has been done. Lord, Cont Lord Contenders Ever Jail. Might as well. I mean, there's a Marika statue here, so... Right, here we go. Might as well put this as we move. Round Table Knight Vike. Ooh, okay. He's put that, like... Dark powers. <laughs> oh god. Nice. Oh, he healed you, son of a bitch. Whoa. That's cool. Oh, Jesus. Whoa. <laughs> What's he doing? You maniac. There we go, stunned him there. Need a heal. Ooh. Fucking hell, this guy's ridiculous. Oh, Jesus Christ.
I can only do so much to stun him. There we go. He's got no Estus anymore. Oh, Jesus. Need more. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so close. Okay, now he's showing off now. <laughs> and he walks away. <laughs> These bosses have style. They just like to show off. They're trying to get their meter up. SSS. Stylish. Well, at least the, the, the snow is cleared up now. We can actually see a little bit more. That's awesome. There's just giants, like frozen giants there too. Alright. Oh. Again. That was a good... Pr oh shit. Why did I use that? <laughs> That was a bit dumb of me. I thought it was... I had no mana. Just kind of got used to it. There we go. He's gonna heal, that's fine. Oh, he rolled over it. Oh! <laughs> Whoosh. You got me good there. This might be a while. <laughs> I could switch to my, um, Moon Veil, but... I probably have more success. With the Comet, I reckon, so... Stopped him from doing that. That's good. Let's go run. Oh wow! He can he can actually hit me like that. twice through it. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's good. What a, what a trade that was. <laughs> I forgot I had that on equipped. Vikes Dragon Bolt. And then fingerprint set. Oh yeah, I have a I have 112,000 souls as well. <laughs> oh god. Um, where is the fingerprint set? Where out foul? Oh, there it is. Iron Helm's singed? Singed. Singed. I think it's singed. And blistered by fingers. Worn by Vike, Knight of the Round Table. Hold. None other. No other tarnished was closer to the throne than the Elden. Of the Elden Lord than Vike. But without announcement, Vike travelled far be below the capital and was scorched by the flame of frenzy. Did he make his choice from his, from his maiden, or did some other force lure him without suggestion? Did 
It was this guy down here. It was this guy. It was Sh Sharibi. Good old Sharibi. In the tide of battle. Oh, big doggo. Oh, God. We had another castle as well. It was very exciting. I do want to head over to the rise first. Yeah, probably should hit these balloons. I don't know what they're called. Oop. There we go. Hold the rune tier 12, that is wonderful. Yeah, so that rise is going to be... ...sealed away, but that's okay. Falling snow marks something unseen. Oh. Oh, there's another one. Shit. <laughs> Holy crap. I think there might be enemies inside as well. Oh, there's another balloon thing. Falling snow marks something unseen. Well, snow is falling. <laughs> Regardless of, of that, like, hint or riddle. There we go. <laughs> We've got the bird helm. Oh, we can go down from there. And backstab. Whoa. <laughs> Off he goes. I think I might have to hit it with uh, Loretta's great bow here. <laughs> Holy shit. His back just got men just went mental there. That was just something else. Actually, almost died. Well, that was close. Oh god, I'm almost dead though. Almost dead. Hey. 
even see him shoot the other three arrows there, or bolts. There we go. Running a little low here. Oh, thank god. That's one way to kill an enemy. <laughs> Falling snow marks something unseen. Because I'm pretty sure... I think these might be like hidden turtles. I think. Or something like that. But I'm not entirely sure where exactly I should be looking. If this is like scattered throughout the entire map or if this is like in a small section. I'm just I just don't really I'm not hundred percent what I'm looking for. up to be honest because otherwise I'm going to be stuck for like 30 minutes trying to figure out problem is it's, it's what it's saying as well it's like there's no falling already falling snow marks something unseen Jesus. What's something that I can't see yet? There's usually like a hint of something moving. Or there should be something, like there should be a hint of something moving or something. A heretical rise, that's what this place is called. Um, yeah, I should just look it up, I reckon. Like, I don't want to waste too much time on this, because I reckon it'll take, like, 40 minutes at the max just trying to, like, find something. Uh, vertical rise, okay. Yeah, that's... Luckily, there's a handy interactive map that you can use. Which has helped me immensely. Okay, so where is it? Where, where art thou? There it is. There's, some, there's something else I missed. Just looked at the map. <laughs> there was something else I missed. Um, I clicked on the wrong thing. What? How did I click on the wrong thing? Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whoops. Um, okay. Oh, what? Oh, okay. I don't want to look at it too much longer because... It kind of... Huh, okay. I don't, I, 
I looked at what was happening, but I didn't see where it was happening. So I'm, I have to kind of, I'm kind of guesstimating. Plus, I have 122,000 souls on me as well, and there's no bonfire. Oh shit, just jumped back, stepped a little bit. <laughs> Let me drop down here. Oh, cool. There's the baronet. There's those guys moving around in there. That's a good sign. Um, oh, my goodness. I think it might, might have to do whatever is over there, perhaps. Kind of alluding to it. So did I pick up this gold seed that's down here? Looks like there's a gold seed. Hopefully I can get up from where I am. Oh boy. Slow and steady. <laughs> I've already picked up the gold seed here. Um. Let me up. There we go. But from here, I'm probably... Nah. Oh. Nah, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go the whole way around then. Might as well, yeah, might as well actually just make it over to the bond to the side of Grace. <laughs> All right, the blop here. Almost up to 200 here. 200 FP. So I think this puzzle is kind of similar to something that happened that's in a previous game. In Dark Souls 3, if you remember, in um, Anna Londo. It's like an in there's something invisible. So we do need to make it over to the, the minor Erd tree. That was an awesome jump. <laughs> 
It would have been better if I actually made it all the way, but it's a good attempt. I'm pretty much, I think we have to travel through where um, Gold Mask and Corrin are. Yeah. <laughs> is there and <laughs> it seems to me I don't know where oh I actually don't know if it's, is it this one got a solution <laughs> how many how many throwies do i have how many rainbow stones do i have one there you go it okay, so to be honest i actually don't know okay i need to refer back to it <laughs> i need to refer back to this Oh, I see. Oh, okay. And also there's a bonfire there. I didn't even notice there was a bonfire there. What the fuck? There's a bonfire just right there. How did I not notice this? <laughs> Holy shit. Unbelievable. All right. Uh, we do need to probably do this. Safely move over there. Die. Oh, Jesus. You hit from the back. Oh, these guys come back to life, right? What about that? <laughs> okay, so this is like a bridge that looks like it leads towards thing here throw that oh yep yeah. oh it works might as well put them um, I might as well put these on the um on the hot bar here um I think I just went by <laughs> I just went by it there it is there they are Ooh. 
Okay, I see like a little bit of a breeze going on. In slightly, it's like I slightly notice a path. Okay, we can move forward. I don't know if this is just a straightaway. I, I want to be careful. Should be the thumbnail. <laughs> it should be the thumbnail. Hang on. Well, it might be the thumbnail. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. It's so cool. It's so cool that I'm just floating in the sky like this. Similar moment happened in Dark Souls 3. I think there was some other moments too. In the other Dark Souls games. Yeah, oh, okay. Need to head up. We go. We're up. Seal on the rise opened. Very cool. That's a very awesome. That was a very awesome puzzle there. Even though <laughs> it was weird seeing it, but I think you could probably kind of like guesstimate it. Guess that that could have like that could be a like a puzzle if you were to look at the bridge there and go oh that's right actually why does that connect to the rise and then you can actually go there and you see oh actually I'm spinning out of control <laughs> Oh, mental. Marinettes. Bloody marinettes. Fuck again. Oh. Spooky for me. Jesus. I'm always getting the bird helms. I don't like that. And that's the entrance. Time to head up. Tumbleweed. <laughs> the snow tumbleweed that's here. For some reason. And off it goes. <laughs> Oh, we should check out that spell as well that we got. Founding Rain of Stars. Legendary spell. Okay. You got my attention. You got my attention. I just just sneezed there. That's why. <laughs> oh. Little bit of a sneeze. All right. We're done with this. Um, I 
before we do anything else, before we head over that way, I reckon it would be a good idea to head here. Head back here. Take those two spells out. I was actually expecting another memory stone, but wasn't a hundred percent on that. Um, oh, we can use it. Oh, requires two slots. Comet Azur requires three slots. I didn't even realize. As well. Oh my goodness. Release a downpour of star rain for a while. And then the other spell we got uh, was the incantation. Vike's Dragon Bolt. We'll check this one out first. 23 faith required. Um, incantation of Vike, Knight of the Round Table. Hold. Summons red lightning to bolster both the caster's body and their ornaments held in their right hand. Enchants ornaments with lightning infinity attack attacks and increase maximum equip load. However, lightning damage negation will be reduced. Of all the knights, Bike the Dragon Spear was one was the one Lanciax loved the most. And then we got the downpour of the founding reign of stars. Eldest primeval sorcery said to have been discovered by an ancient astrologer, a sorcery of legendary status. Summons a dark cloud of stars overheard overhead shortly after the cloud will release a violent del deluge, deluge of star rain. This sorcery can be cast while in motion. Charging increases potency. Or to, to be a be the be the founding glintstone sorcery, the glimpse of the prime evil current. That the astrologer saw became real and the stars em amber rained down on this land. Actually, I'll equip it. I have enough for it. Let's have a look. Oh, wow, that's cool. And then I can charge it. That increases the damage. Oh yeah, that's gonna be useful. It's probably gonna be pretty interesting to use in, ba in battle. Excuse me. Jesus. Oh. Alright, so one thing I did see when I was looking it up, looking up how to figure out how to get the heretical yeah, heretical rise puzzle. So you also saw that there was a... Yep, okay, there's a dungeon here. I would have expected it to be something like this, so... We do need two stone sword keys for this, yep. Spirit Caller Cave. Bloody dark in here. Thank God for. Thank God for starlight. I mean, if, if only it lasted a lot longer. Oh. I think I just went by a trap. That's like a falling. I think that's for me to fall down into. But I just went around it, not knowing that was a trap there. Oh. Do need to take that out. Yep. This is cool. I like these kind of caves, to be honest. Break right that. Very moody. Kind of reminds me of like Skyrim, a little bit. Skyrim caves. In a way. Um.
Just holding my shield out for the best. Hoping for the best here. Who the hell just got summoned? Disciple of Akino in a bar. Oh shit. Whoa! Samurai. Oh, he's dead. Freezing Greece. I think this is where it would be dropped down into. Oh boy. Fucking snail. No, oh, I didn't get seen. Ooh, white reed armor. There goes all the wolves. Or half of them. I, I see another. I see where the other thing is. Oh, okay, no, someone knows. Oh, he summoned them again! Get out of here! Um, I, am I safe to look it up? Look at the armor. I think I am. There it is. Armor of the white reeds, fashioned from banded iron plates, worn by the by the Inaba, heads disciples of the great swordsman Okina. Or Okina. You know. The Inaba traveled the in pursuit of not only the master who abandoned them, but also proper deaths. One honorably through hard fought combat. To the writ white reed is to seek death fitting for the Anaba, who des desired nothing more than to die by the sword. I think we've reached the end. Yep, we've reached the end. I did want to explore a little bit more. There was like another path I could take, possibly. So, I do want to explore that little bit. What was this too? So much going on. Oh, this is where I would be dropped down into. I think that little section if I was to guess oh items here on rune tier 10 rune arc and hero's rune Year one. All right. Getting that founding rain, rain of stars ready for the battle ahead. Bum, 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 bum. Okay. 
Ah, oh, should have used the Windrush last first. Oh, God skin. There we go. I mean, that's pretty good. Slash at the end of our moon veil. Oh shit, there's another one! <laughs> no, I thought the battle was over. I get to hear this wonderful song though. Broken. Whoa. Oh, Jesus. Do I have to fight both of them? I think so. Both of them at once? Spirit call a snail. Get him. Get him. Get him. You. Oh, we've got a spell. Jesus. Godskin swaddling. <laughs> swaddling cloth. And black flame ritual. That looks disgusting. <laughs> Sacred cloth of the godskin apostles made from supple skin sewn together. Successive attacks restore HP. The gloam eyed queen cradles newborn apostles swaddled in this cloth. Soon they will grow to become the death of the gods. Uh, 105,000 souls as well. Might as well rest up. Or if it's very dark here. We have the light, at least. Uh, we'll bring up our, our vigor up again. Might as well. And then that spell, that new spell. Can we use it? It's an incantation. It's another an incantation. Of course it is. Of course it is. Um, summons a circle of black flame pillars around Caster. Superior Black Flame Incantation of the Godskin Apostle. Uh, charging it, increasing... Charging increases the size of the circle. The gloam-eyed queen led the apostles. It is said that she was an Empyrean chosen by the fingers. And me knowing... Well... Pretty cool. <laughs> it's pretty cool. I was just going to say... Um, at least I actually know what Empyrean is, thanks to good old Shimigami Tensei. Shimigami Tensei 5. Empyrean is like the... Like the high... Like, or... I think it's the, like the highest layer of heaven. Or something like that. Oh, look at this night sky. It's so cool. So, I think the castle will be the final thing we do this session, I reckon. I think we'll save the medallion, the Halig Tree secret medallion for the next session, I reckon. I'd say. Um, saving, I'll save that for, for another time, perhaps. Yeah, 
go. Sit up. Could have just fast traveled there, but that's okay. Oh, all right. Oh, didn't, didn't trigger there. There it goes. Saw something big moving around. Oh, it's the big doggo. It's a lot of health. And there's the red one, which I don't really need to kill, but an item here. Explosive Great Bolt. Oh, side of Grace there. How convenient. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's a, yeah, that's the thumbnail. <laughs> You see the castle on the right there too, and the hut and the the ur tree. That's the thumbnail. <laughs> there it is. Okay. White Ridge Road. I just rested again. God damn it. Didn't want to rest again. Stealth. In a little bit. Good. Starting to notice me. I don't want to summon just yet. Jump up there. <laughs> Let me jump up there, please. Let me do it. Oh, oh my goodness, I'm hitting the whatever's... Oh shit. I was just gonna say, hopefully that guy doesn't go. Can't we just fucking destroy me out of nowhere? <laughs> fucking did it. He fucking did it. Oh, what a legend. That was expected. Oh, 
just speed running. Speed running. Oh, she's gonna drop down from there. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Good to deal with those first, I reckon. Might as well summon these. And... Oh, I'd only get the one. rate went down a little bit there. I mean, the frame rate's going down all the time, but it's more noticeable. Oh, Jesus. Okay, he's dead. Oh, that doesn't one shot. There we go, good stuff. Night Maiden and Swordstress doing a good job here. Well, they see me. Oh, okay. I have to be quick about this. Oh, there we go. a good time to do that wasn't it I should have just went like and slammed him in the back there but oh boy oh that could have that could have been cool <laughs> He goes get out of here oh Jesus I'm gonna roll away I don't have the stamina why is that missing why is that aiming a little bit lower than I need Get out of here. Nice, we've done it. We've well, at least cleared these guys out. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, Ash of War. Prelates charge. Sounds interesting. I don't want to go too far. Hang on. Ten. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to do that. <laughs> I want to bring him back. Bring him out. Oh, we'll take him away, sorry. I want to do that. I'm going to go in here. Oh, they're probably going to disappear, though. If I'm going into this. Guardian's Garrison. Oh, doggo. Flame Guardian. Ah. The Flame Guardian doesn't know what to do. <laughs> Night Maiden and Swordstress, too good. Oh, rat. Always interested. <laughs> Tasty rat. Smoldering butterfly. Um, 
We don't have a spirit card here and doesn't know what to do over. Oh no. They're very dazed, dazed and confused. That's what they are. Oh, ladder. Okay. Oh, rat again. More rat. Oh, doggo. Out of nowhere. Hang on. Let's just... Okay. Just needed the help there. Go up. Is there going to be a boss here? I wonder. There's two of them. Oh, really? Oh, ble he bleeds in two shots. Spirit Guardians, okay. Wow, ah, that's good. Um, is that... Can't be all, is it? Uh, it doesn't look like it. It's like a pole tower bit. Maybe we can climb up. Um... It looks like we can get over there, but... Oh, shit. Okay, I thought I was gonna die, <laughs> to be honest. Yeah, so we can go over here. Looks like looks like there's a way to get up to the tower, I think. From up here, perhaps. Up on there. There might be a back entrance, I'm not entirely sure. Oh, okay, we're back. Was that it? I hope that wasn't it. Oh, wait. Hang on. One moment. I've got an idea. It involves jumping. <laughs> it involves jumping over. I think... There might be a way to get around through... Yeah, 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 yeah. I see, I see, I see, I see. Yep. Okay. Secret thing here. Go up this way. Oh, doggo. There's a doggo right there. He just saw his friend die. No significance of what's in here, but. Oh, Jesus! Chief Guardian! What kind of shield is that? Aganafi? Aganafi? I don't know how you pronounce that. Oh god. Oh! Okay. <laughs> oh, I wanted to see what you do with the... Do something with the shield. It looked like he was going to do something with the shields. Come on. Do it. Oh, come on. Wow. Jesus. Okay, well, he's got one of the people. Oh, just shoot! Just shoot it! I want to see you do it! Come on! Don't be shy! Sure, hey? Here we go! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> it's like my, um, cannon of Aima. 
Except built into a shield and shoots fire. that out so quickly. Look at that shield. That's a cool shield though. I'll assume that has like faith requirements. Right, we'll just go through here without needing to worry about any of the enemies here so. Hey, that was easy. That wasn't though. Oh shit. Oh bloody hell. doing what the hell oh in mid air that was fucking awesome in hang on yes the gavel the gavel returns one eyed shield Oh, it has dex, uh, dex scaling, okay. Trixum shield made from white stone depicting a malformed one-eyed god. The barrel of a firearm pokes through the open mouth. Once worshipped by the giants, this evil deity is believed to have been slain by Queen Marika. Unique skill, flame spit. Ready to shield, then launch a fireball from the barrel. Fireball explodes on impact. Right, let's see what's at the top of the tower. Boom, 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 boom. Ooh, chest. <laughs> when the night maiden, the night maiden or sword stress teleported up here. <laughs> there they are. Quite far. Okay. Giant's prayer book. Prayer book that contains the secrets of the fire giants, kept hidden by the prelates who monitor the giant's flame, can be given to a learnt cleric. Gain access to the following incantations. Giant's flame take thee, and flame fall upon them. Okay. That's pretty cool. Um... We'll take this fast travel. We'll take that to Corrin. 
because he's the only one that learns the incantations, I think. Um, see what we can get out of it. We might as well buy it, those spells, even though we don't have the, the requirements for incantations, but it's still good to have. is still there. Well, I'm moving away from that. <laughs> okay, good. They're both there. Both still there. something else yes here's a prayer book that is a work of heresy its incantations bear no lineage from the earth tree <sighs> very well I'll take it off your hands I cannot afford to maintain my innocence any longer I must dirty my hands to test my faith even if it offers only the most meager of hints I will do whatever I can to help my master all right oh these are expensive spells um giants flame take the 30 30 faith requirements hurls a massive ball of raging flame one of the incantations that draws directly from the power of the fire giants charging enhances potency and causes the ball to fight ball of fire to explode there is no record of this incantation in common prayer books. Only a select few prelates know of its existence. Flame fall upon them. Hurl several balls of fire at once. Charging enhances potency and causes the balls of fire to explode. Requires 28 faith. pretty cool don't you say gold mask <laughs> all right um yeah i reckon we're, we're good to go here i reckon we're good with, with ending the session off right here i think yeah i think that's a good time to, to end it off so next session, what I'm going to do is I reckon we'll head back to the Grand Rift Lift rolled. Um, and then from there, we'll see where that takes us. I would assume it might actually take us take us down to this part of the region. Just looking at what we've seen on the map here. Um, not before, I think... Maybe getting the map of this part of the um, the, the mountain top, but I'm not a hundred percent on that. So um, we'll see how we go, though. But anyways, that's gonna be it for me. I uh, thank you everyone so much for watching this session of Elden Ring. If you guys enjoyed it. If you missed the previous episodes of Done for the series, you can check it out by playlist on the right side of the screen. On the left side of the screen, a playlist of other games I've played in the past or currently playing at the moment. So if you want to check those out as well. You can. And in the middle, you can go ahead and subscribe to the channel to stay up to date on games such as this and any other games we're playing at the moment. Anyway, thank you everyone so much for watching this. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys next time. Goodbye.